Good morning. Today we're looking at example 4 out of section 3.1, Marginal Functions and Difference Quotient. We're going to start with data for profit, and we want to find the marginal profit function. We're first going to need to produce a projected profit function. So as we do, we start with data. From that data, I'm going to insert a scatter plot. From the scatter plot, I look at it and I say, I believe this is a quadratic function, so I want to do a polynomial function of degree 2. I'd like to display the equation on the chart. I'm going to make the equation on the chart. I'm going to take the equation on the chart and make it bigger so that it's easier to read. I have a profit function, a projected profit function. I'm going to copy it and paste it into my projected profit function. Now I'd like to do the normal conversion from mathematics to Excel. This is times a 7 squared and times a 7. I'm going to be interested in looking at the formulas, so I like to go to formulas, show formulas. and make that formula big enough to see it because besides the projected profit at x, I want the projected profit at x plus 1. The easiest way to do that is I'm going to copy this and paste it in. And everywhere I see an a7, I'm going to replace that by parentheses a7 plus 1. And here, again, I'm going to replace a7 by parentheses, a7 plus 1, close parentheses. My marginal profit is going to be equal to the projected profit at x plus 1 minus the projected profit at x. I then do my quick fill. It will fill in the rest of the cells. I don't need to see a formula anymore. So now I have my profit and my projected profit, my pro projected profit and projected marginal profit. Looking at it, I think the marginal profit is going to go to zero. That's when increasing stops being useful somewhere around 79 or 80. So I'm simply going to fill down these values, 79 or 80, that looks like a good place. So that would be about where I want to stop increasing. This lets me look at that and say, the 80th object, I increase my profit when I go from 80 to 81, my profit decreases, so I want to stop at 80. Thank you.